Hitting the hardwood for a good cause. Happening now in Northfield Center, dancing for disease. New Channel 5's Dave Arnold shows us how couples were first practicing clicking up their heels in Chagrin Falls, all to stop cancer. Bob and Karen Gates have fun every day kicking up their heels at the Fred Astaire Dance Studio. But for a couple dancing for 30 years, prepping for an event tonight has a meaning much more deep. It is dancing with the survivors, and obviously it's breast cancer survivors. Uh, it's related to the Pink Fund, and really proud to be a part of it. The Pink Fund dedicates itself to providing cancer patients during treatment financial assistance to cover non medical expenses. The fund says meeting those basic needs decreases patient stress levels, contributing to strengthening their ongoing fight. This studio has the right touch to help. You're looking at each other like that. An instructor since 1978, Bob is throwing in his expertise to one of four local student dancers who are dedicated to fighting cancer for the Pink Fund. Yeah, I've had a few people in my family with uh, cancer. My grandmother had breast cancer and eventually died of that. So it, it's very important to me and, and um, uh, to, to do this, and it's exciting. Mary Beth is as smooth a student as they come. The right moves, spins, and touch to shine tonight. Losing her mother to breast cancer over a decade ago, this benefit has her tying up her laces in support. You know, it means a lot to me to be able to, as I said, do something outside of myself. I lost my mom to breast cancer in 2001. Even the smallest donation um, can make a difference. Remember, you don't actually have to dance to donate to this great cause. On your side in Chagrin Falls, I'm Dave Arnold, News Channel 5. And if you think you'd like to dust off your best dance moves tonight in support of breast cancer, Gambitta's Party Center can be found at 160 East Aurora Road in Northfield Center. And for more information, go to newsnet5.com.